since when is May, like November. Uh, this is the first time I think I, in, 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 in my recent history while gaming, I can remember a May that's going to be as strong as this May. I mean, we have Battleborn, we have Overwatch, we have Doom, we have um, the Fallout DLC. I've just never seen a May with this many titles and this many powerful AAA titles and this many great franchises coming out at the same time. I hope this is a trend. Um, usually we get all these great games in November and October and September and then you sit there for the next four or five months trying to play them all because you get them all at the same time. And then you hit the summer and you're bored out of your damn mind. There's nothing to play. There's nothing to do. There's no really good games coming out. There's nothing really hitting the market. This year's different. This year you're going to have Overwatch. This year you're going to have Battleborn. This year you're going to have Doom. You're going to fall out. You're going to be able to explore all these games in their, in their fullest because we have time. We finally have time. We finally have these new titles for the summer. It's your boy, Big Doula. Watch, like, comment, subscribe, share. Enjoy the channel. We have new video game uh, discussions every Wednesday. Peace. Hey, what's up? This is your boy, Big Doula, here at the Lord Kings. Top of the mind, talking about video games. Now, in the last two to three years or so, we've seen the resurgence of single-player role-playing games, single-player, uh, longer-form content.